Movement. All right, welcome back at 620 on a Saturday morning. Rain continues to move its way out of Kansas City, leaving us with just a little bit of cloud cover here in the downtown area as we look live from our Bordner City camera on our tower at 31st and Grand Point in North. Downtown just looks fantastic this morning. All lit up pretty. You can see the Kauffman Center, the Bartle Hall uh, Sky Spires. I think those are what those are called, if I remember right. And then again, the Power and Light built Sky Stations. That's right. That gummit. Well, I guess there goes the perfect show for the uh, the day. I already messed up once. 620. Live power Doppler again, showing that rain moving off here to our northeast. Those are the showers that were coming through as I woke up around three o'clock this morning. Again, dry within the 435 loop. It looks like at least maybe a few showers here east of Odessa and then Garnett and then parts south of Butler picking up a little bit rain now as well. 51 with the south wind at 16 miles per hour, 89% humidity. We'll see the wind shift a little bit later today, and I'll show you that here in just a second 63 degrees. I think the sun will make its uh, face known a few times today, but I think a lot of the day will be in the clouds uh, for us. Now, while we're just dealing with a cool little uh, not decent weekend, parts down to our southeast are going to be dealing with severe weather again today. I know on Thursday we saw that big outbreak of tornadoes down here near the Alabama area. Just a little bit north, we're kind of bullseye on Memphis here. They're under an enhanced risk for severe weather, so something again will be watching. Our rain chances isolated for today. That's just because of the rain that's moving out right now. I think for the most part after that rain is out of here, we have a dry weekend through Monday. And then a cold front approaches the area here on Tuesday into Wednesday which will bring us our next chance of rain. But for the next few days, I think we're going to be dry here for the most part. Forecast track. Here is the rain pushing off to our northeast. You can see a little bit of a southerly wind right now, but there's the wind shift. And by tomorrow morning, we'll have wind out of the northwest, but dry and sunny conditions. As we go into Monday, you'll see the wind shift again, this time out of the southwest. Monday is going to be a pretty breezy day as we have a really tight pressure gradient from low pressure up into the northwest. It's really going to bring us some gusty winds. But along with those gusty winds, we get some warmer temperatures. We'll see temperatures near 70 on Monday. Tuesday, you saw that cold front kind of push through and start to bring rain chances there Tuesday into Wednesday. Security makes seven day forecast. Just a 10% of those showers moving off to the east today. 62 on your Palm Sunday. Windy on Monday but 70 degrees as we drop back down into the 50s for Tuesday and Wednesday. And I'm circling Thursday because it's one of my favorite days of the year, Carolina. It's opening day at the K, 60 degrees, hoping for a Royals win and some uh, and mostly sunny skies. How exciting to see that baseball is coming back now this year. I know I've, I haven't caught any spring training games this season, but I'm so pumped up for uh, for Thursday for opening day. It's going to be a good one. Yeah, it'll be a great day. New